I forgot to upload my other video, but <clears throat> I will upload it before I upload this one, so if you're watching this one, you probably just finished watching the other one, or vice versa, whatever. Um, it's me, Zura, again. I'm back. Um, I am currently hanging out. I'm a little tired, but whatever. That's cool. It's my weekend before Animated Brass Con. Um, I'm gonna be suading dolls tonight and painting, um, Time's little full set stuff. Ah, his hat. Bad hat. His little hat stuff. He's so cute. I love him so much. So, so cute. Look at that little face. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> um, I've just been sitting here, um, Thinking about dolls and stuff like that. I've been watching people's videos and Ampicaro got a new A-Zone. And that made me kind of like, I should probably play with my A-Zones. Because I hadn't really played with them since middle of summer. That was the last time I think I messed with them. It was before I got Sebastian. And then after... And then I got Sebastian and I kind of stopped playing with my A-Zones. But I took the liberty and I changed them and played with them a little bit. And so Hana is all decked out in her nice warm gear. And she's she's ready for fall and winter and whatever this stuff throws at her. And she's so cute. She's a teacher Minami A-Zone. Um, if you see her around, uh, she's probably on the single jointed body thing. Uh, the not very poseable body for... I don't know if it's it's not jointed. It's a, it's the not very poseable body. It's the A Zone Body One version one, not the version two or whatever. And so she's um. I bought her and then I uh took her head off of the body and I bought a more poseable body and sold the other one. So. Um. So I've been playing with her a little bit. I'll probably like take pictures later. I should do that while I'm awake. I'm gonna go to sleep in a little while and then I'll be up all night. Probably suading dolls and such. Cause I've got a lot of suading done. I, I've got a lot of suading I need to do. Sebastian's not so bad because his body belonged to a previous owner that had suaded it right before he came here. So he's good. Uh, time doesn't really need suaded. But unfortunately, Emmeline, Briella, Brian, my husband's OSD Dark Elf Sue needs suaded. Yumi needs resuaded. Yeah. Like six or seven dolls need suaded tonight. Something to that effect. So we're going to be doing a lot of restringing and suading this evening. And I'll be doing painting because I said that I was going to paint times full set and I didn't get to it last weekend. So that means this weekend that's what I am doing. So, <clears throat> I've got a lot of doll stuff going on, but I wanted to make another update. Um, I We managed to get some of my stuff paid off, some of my debt. We like rearranged our finances and cut some things there and cut some things there, you know, that fun stuff. And uh, I managed to get it so where I'm going to buy my friend's full drag, the full dragon seed I'm um, also gonna she is has uh, kindly offered to help me get uh, one of the new baby dragons those little Pico dragons are so cute I want one so bad so I'll get that dragon and then fairly I just grr, they made me really mad because I was planning on just skipping this event entirely. I wasn't really interested in, you know, the new, the any of the event heads. I wasn't really interested in getting any more dolls other than maybe the real Pookie TT. I just wasn't really interested in this event as much. And then they did a 180 and said, we're going to release a whole bunch of lines in tan. And I went, grr. Because I wanted a tan Pookie Fee Bonnie last year. Um, and I just missed the event. And that's what made me buy Yumi. My Pookie Pookie uh, Ruby. 
So now I have a chance to get her. My husband wanted a tan little fee last year and he didn't get that. So now he's going to be getting that. And I'm also going to be buying some like extra hands for my tan Bonnie and extra and I think I'll probably end up buying uh, the real Pookie TT. Now, I'm probably not going to get the TT full set. I'm thinking about it, but I could probably live without it. I did get the event hat from this last time, so I could probably just throw that on top of his head, so he'll be alright. But I think I'll probably end up doing that. So that means in the next coming months I'll be getting another four dolls. <laughs> Addicted. Of course I haven't really gotten a lot. Um, I got Yumi. Then I, because I, I, at the beginning of the year, I bought my, I got, I didn't buy him, I bought him, what, a year ago? I sold that big black tortoise gen she that I freaked out over. He was just way too big, I wasn't used to the size. Maybe if I had done SD and then eased into the 70 centimeter size, I could have dealt with it more. But I just didn't do it. I just went straight from like MSD and tinies to giant. And I wasn't ready to handle it. I couldn't handle the heat. So I had to get out of that kitchen. So I ended up selling him. And because he was a limited edition and in gray skin and in perfect condition. I had just given him a face up and some body blushing. And... I took the body blushing off like the person who bought it wanted and they kept the face up and yada yada. So they got a really nice doll. I miss him sometimes but not really. I, li I liked the gray skin I think. I thought that was cool. And the dragon claws were really cool. But he was just too much for me to handle. So he had to go. And that's how I got Briella and Emmeline. And they both came in June, something like that. And uh, then from there, I when they came, I got the event full, the event plate for the Sarang faceplate, and I was like, I'm just gonna face it up and sell it. No, and then I faced it up and I fell in love with it. Of course, silly me. So I. Uh, have a that's how Sebi came to be and I bought his body and stuff second hand and then um, right before that I bought time and so time and Sebastian came together really fast now they're like one of my favorite some of my favorite character original characters because they ow river I don't want to play with you. Go away. And so, uh, they're, they're pretty awesome. I'm really excited with where my hobby's going. I'm completely rambling about doll purchases and selling. But, I don't know. I don't really have a lot of, I haven't really talked a lot to doll people lately. I haven't been going to doll meets because I work Saturdays. And the meets are usually at, like, noon on Saturdays and last in the afternoon. And I work at 10 till 7 in the morning or 8, whatever. Whenever they let me go. They own my soul. So, I pretty much... Pretty much haven't been going because I've just been way too tired and just dead to the world. So, one of these days I'll go to another meet, but I will be going to, th this weekend I'll be seeing a whole ton of them, and I haven't seen them for months. They haven't seen Emmeline or Briella. Yeah, June was the last one I went to, I think, and that was right before I got my dolls. So, Emmeline, Briella, Sebastian, Time, they haven't seen any of them. 
that's not true though that's not true i've been sharing on on pages obviously like pictures and stuff but seeing them in person is always different so i'm really excited to see my doll people and mm, sorry if i've been rambling and you really don't care about any of this don't watch it i'm sorry but i just wanted to get some rambling stuff off my chest maybe i'll do a bg addicts thing i said i would last time but i didn't so i'm gonna do it this time i promise so, I will end this video here. It's like 10 minutes long. Good God. Um, thanks for watching. Bye.